The G.I. Joes are back on the big screen in G.I. Joe Retaliation, starring Bruce Willis and Dwayne Johnson. It's an action-packed adventure that sees them not only fighting their mortal enemy Cobra, but contending with threats from within the U.S. government that jeopardize their very existence. Only one man could authorize a strike like that. And I voted for him. I think it's part of the tradition of G.I. Joe is to constantly reinvent it, whether it was the cartoon, to the toy line, to the, uh, to the, uh, to the comic book, to the first movie. I uh, was sort of in that tradition, and, and I love getting in there and, and, and giving it a little more grit. You know, we really wanted you to feel the power of the punch. And of course, when you bring in Dwayne The Rock Johnson, you bring Bruce Willis, you bring Channing Bag, and you mix them all up, there's a fun, uh, there's a fun element of adventure in that. We have to assume that there's no one we can trust. Actor Dwayne there Johnson's also a professional wrestler known as The Rock General, in the ring. Call me Joe. I don't shower for three weeks. Um, I, you know what I do? I spend a lot of time with the director. That was important. Um, and, and really just get into it. I have felt like I have known G.I. Joe and I have all my life because I played with G.I. Joe's when I was a kid. I was G.I. Joe when I was a kid. Let's get to work. With its release date delayed by several months to reshoot some scenes after test screenings and add 3D, G.I. Joe Retaliation opens in the UK this week. The president says they can't come out of retirement. They didn't say anything about re-enlisting. 